With parents serving their country overseas and stateside face unique challenges that many may never understand. Today, a ceremony brought together hundreds of young people as they celebrate their parents and their service to our country. San Diego 6's Carlos Correa is in Camp Pendleton for their special tribute. Good afternoon to you. The flag ceremony isn't just about honoring servicemen and women, but teaching kids here on base about responsibility, creativity, and hard work. Twelve-year-old Brandon Jenkins has waited weeks for this special day. I'm not nervous at all. The first flag ceremony of the school year. A moment to honor students' success and the many parents at Mary Fay Elementary on the base of Camp Pendleton. Say good morning. Wait for them to get quiet and then say what you have to say. Brandon is the first to talk about military parents and what Old Glory represents. Good morning, everyone. But he's not the last. But the saddest thing is that they are far away from their family and don't get to see them that much. Most of the 800 students at Mary Fay have seen a parent deployed, fighting in war, but have also experienced a strong love for our country. But for these kids, it's very real for them. And so when we sing a song that talks about the man who died, who gave that right to me, it really hits home. Twelve-year-old Kaylin Tamer is honoring her father. Like many of these students, she learned at a very young age how important our military is to our nation. They're out there fighting um, for the country, and my dad is in the Navy. So um, things like this really bring it into perspective of what my dad and what he really does every day. School leaders say the flag ceremony helps bring this young community together as some wait for mom and dad to come home. And I won't forget the man who died who gave that right to me. Oh, man, that was good. That was good. That was... Touch my heart. And the celebration of student success doesn't just happen at these assemblies. It happens year-round. I'm Carlos Correa, San Diego 6 News. Carlos, thank you.